This is Zhang, chomping and swinging like his fellow Francois Langers, even after two cancer surgeries. The intervention is the first of its kind. Dr. Katherine Gamble noticed the tumor in Zhang's mouth, a cancer that's typically fatal. Lincoln Park identified several years ago that this is a problem for the species uh, with the tumor. And up to this point, it had never been identified at an early enough stage to do something. But Dr. Gamble had a plan. She just needed help and reached out to Rush head and neck surgeon, Dr. Kirsten Stenson. They emailed me and first it was very, this is very cool. <laughs> I want to help. After weeks of coordination, Dr. Stenson moved her whole OR team to the zoo in May 2022 to remove the cancer on the roof of Zhang's mouth. His head is the size of a baby's head. Um, the teeth are much sharper, I guess, and we worked our way around, around that. Zhang did great in surgery and post-op, but the zoo realized he needed another surgery one year later. And so we brought Dr. Kirsten in for a second procedure to help us move things around a little bit to try to cover a little bit more of the exposed bone. Zhang recovered from the surgeries by watching cartoons, but the zoo only allowed him a couple of hours each day. Just, only two hours a day, Dr. Oh, Catherine's mean. Zhang doesn't seem to mind. After one more checkup next week, Zhang can officially be declared cancer free. We're at 18 months and we don't have tumor back, so we're very pleased with that. It, it is amazing and just very, very, very humbling. Dr. Gamble won't take the credit for saving his life. I think Dr. Kirsten certainly did, and we were able to work together to make sure that he got back with his group, and now I think we can say we've saved the whole species line. Zhang is the only male with three females in his family group, so there's high hopes for future Langers, and now a cancer-fighting process for other animals as well. We have developed a really sound plan that allows us to do what we need to do and make them comfortable. And just how it all came together was, was short of um, amazing. At Lincoln Park Zoo, Lauren Petty, NBC5 News.